<laughs> to ensure that your relationship thrives and that you and your partner enjoy your time together to the fullest this Christmas, we'll be taking a look at Dr. John Gottman's lip, lip, <laughs> lip, lip, list of tips. Uh, <laughs> for really filling your holiday season with romance. Hold on, hold on, uh, hold on, 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 I know I forget it for Christmas. <laughs> Glasses. <laughs> he was doing so well. Yeah, that's funny. But the man couldn't get past the lipstick tips. The lips. <laughs> The first one says that you must give love, not gifts. Not gifts. I'm not certain they're, they're saying you mustn't give gifts. So I think they're suggesting that um, because we're talking about romance, that you, you must give the rift of love. Yeah, but I just, I just feel you say you must give love every single day. Right. And I don't know, but I don't think if you give a gift, it won't hurt the romance. What do you think? I don't think so. <laughs> this man it is saying you to write down 10 qualities about your partner and bits of paper, put them in a jar. With a ribbon around it. Yeah, and, and this, of course, instead of overspending, because sometimes we tend to equate the value of a gift with the amount of love that somebody has yeah. for you. True, true. Um, and the, the, no, that's not fair. It's not fair, but in a sense, I can understand. Right. In other words, if we are partners, I don't think she's going to give a hundred thousand dollars and give me one for ten dollars. Right. You know, so I think she would probably spend a little more on me. Because right. we are partners. Your right? jar is going to be prettier. Yeah, that's that. Right? <laughs> I mean, jar. Bells and whistles and <laughs> ribbons. And as, as we said to the area, I don't know if that gift will hurt the romance. The jar. So I'm giving her all the love, but I can't chew in a little perfume. Yeah, you think her. so. Yeah, that's that. You think so. so. I mean, I'm not sure I the love and say perfume. She said, no, 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 I just need the love. Keep the minute. Right. 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 And then I return it and collect a refund. <laughs> uh, yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> Number two, <laughs> nurture appreciation. Noticing all of the things that your partner does and, and thank them for it. Um, successful couples maintain a five to one ratio of positive to negative interactions. That, that, that's all year round, I think. Yeah. That's right. all year round. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. Um, and oh, by the way, just to add to this one, so simple expressions of appreciation. They say things like, um, I really enjoyed our conversation or enjoyed the dinner or the meal that you prepared. These things are very, very helpful. Here's the thing with me now. It's the way I come to my birthday and Christmas, don't give me no functional gift. Oh, what do you want? Well, something I can... Papa gift. Thank you, <laughs> wearer or something. You know why you give me no iron? So you come on my head and it look like my shirt not smooth. <laughs> I do not want any functional. I'm not give me nothing for my bathroom and no, no. Uh, during the year, if you come to my house, you say, I might need a little yeah. carpet. Well, you yeah. can't buy the carpet. Back. Like you can't see the house need repairs. Thank you very much, the house need repairs. Thank and you, you give your husband a toolkit. Yeah. And say, Happy birthday. No, Carly, no. just tell him to fix no, up. Fix up <laughs> the house. No, I don't yeah. want a functional gift. Just your clocks could have work for you. Something like that. Or a cologne. Very, very work for me. Yeah. <laughs> very work for me. <laughs> <laughs> very, oi. Very work for me. <laughs> 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 this one.